Hello mga tol and welcome back to our 17th gameplay of Watch Dogs Legion At yung mission natin ngayon is to Defanging the Flock Okay, so ang uh, mission natin is to disrupt the Themis at the Tower Bridge So itong map natin uh, Medyo wala ilayo At dito nga sa, sa, sa bridge So before we go uh, Intro muna tayo Let's go Okay. Okay, so maghanap lang muna tayo ng enemies or tra transportation or uh, para mas madali mag uh, magpa-fast travel tayo. As you can see dito sa area dito is almost complete ko na ang uh, mga areas na napuntahan ko. Pero it doesn't mean na kung complete ang map ay eh, na-complete ko na mga missions sa mga side quest. Uh, of Off cam ko ginawa yung mga side quest kasi uh, maganda kasi backstory nito aside lang sa, sa main mission. Pero if you were planning to buy the Watch Dogs Legion, ako sa inyo, advice ko sa inyo na mas uh, kukunin ko yung mga side quest. Kasi maganda talaga yung mga side quest niya. Although meron mga paulit-ulit pero overall okay naman, enjoyable naman ang game. Plus the main missions. Okay, malapit na rin tayo. The bug, nibbling away on the rotting carcass of the once free Britain. Yum, yum. yum. Hello, Resistance fans. You're listening to the Bug Podcast, the objective voice of objection for this most objectionable world. I am Andy, not my real name, so good luck finding me, Monsieur Bloom. My real name is, in fact, Andrew, uh, and I live in, note this down, a deluded pseudo-reality of my own making, which is, in fact, <laughs> the most densely populated place Hello, on Earth these days. Overcrowded, some might say. Joining me, as always, my next-door neighbour in these Netherlands of nonsense. It's Alice. Yes, indeed, it is Alice. Alice, who the bleep is Alice? I am not going to tell you that. This is Albion's primary communications hub, but there's more security here than there is around the Royal Meth Stash. You should start by destroying their encryptors. If your hacking skills are up to snuff, dominating a combat drone or two could help. Copy. Okay, so dito tayo papasok. Ah. Okay. So, may mapasal din tayong uh, gagawin para makakiyat doon. Okay. Oop, tik lang. Yun lang talaga ang area na dapat kong puntahan. Okay, gamit tayo ng camera. Ah, okay. So, drone sa kailangan ko. Hi, Jack. Okay. So kailangan ko ng kailangan ko ng drone, ng cargo drone para Oh, yeah. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Naulugan. Ah, uh, cargo drone kailangan ko. Or, pwede rito. Spider bot. Since hindi ko siya ma-reach. Kung makakaabot, duda lang ako. Ah. Mayroon. Mala, hindi rin. Okay. 
Ano ako na ako ng cargo drone? Ang bilis ginabi na ako. Cargo drone, where are you? Ayun. Ayan. Ayan. Up, up. Ay. Disable comms encryptors sa defanging the flock. Okay, dalawa. So, starting muna tayo dito. Pwede naman tayo tumaas pero sa tingin ko may mga items dito na dapat ko hanapin. Okay. Para makapasok din pala. Kailangan din to. Ayan. Tama. I'm taking you in! So, ito lugar is pataas. Okay. Patay ka. Dami nila. Tapos si last is ito. Yeah. 
easy. Ang dali lang pala nito. That's it for the encryptors. You can now upload the virus using the central antenna. Copy. Okay, so upload the virus to Themis. Ang dali lang pala nito. Lagay ko ba trap? Just in case. Trap dito. Ang dali lang. Kasi mahirap na. Yan. Malamang pupunta siguro mga kalaban dito. Alam nila na merong... Umatake sa server nila. Ayan. No, no, no. These are the algorithmically driven assassin drones. They're just the normal drones that also kill you. Kung ano yun? Ay, um... Ay, ang hirap pala nun. Dali lang. Okay. Hindi kaya to. Hmm. Ay, mabuti nakabalik na si Palmer. Okay. Your teammate has sought out new accommodations in an Albion holding cell. Have London rents really gotten that bad? No problem. It's what I'm here for. Let's do this.
heard something. Do not resist. All right, here it goes. I'm reading the incoming drones. The furnace drones. No, no, no. These aren't the algorithmically driven assassin drones. They're just the normal drones that also kill you. I know it's big and intimidating as antennas go, but you have to stay close to it for the virus upload to work. Ah, the bird. Tiene la... I suggest you leave before someone gets the bright idea to turn yours off. <laughs> Cassie's plan to use drones driven by some social algorithm to dispense justice has backfired. Do you think he's actually read any of those Greek myths he's named his drones after? What's to stop the next plan, and the one after that? Cass is the real problem here. We have to figure out a way to stop him. Look, we can handle his army. We can handle his drones. But you see, Cass, the people them like him. And if we take on the rascal head on, it will only prove the tune he's been singing all along, that dead sick are terrorists. So mm. we take the people's support away, fam? Bags and me have some thoughts on what we gotta do. You lot better come in for a briefing. Okay, so that I was doing the flag mission and uh... I'm not bragging, but I think I'm doing pretty damn good fighting with DeadSec. You wouldn't have been recruited if DeadSec thought you'd be killed that easily. Thank you, sir. I think. <laughs> now let Bagley get under your skin. Job well done. Ay, okay to. Madali lang. Ilan na bang hitman ko dito? 1, 2... Pero mas kailangan ko ng hitman eh. Ala John Wick. <laughs> Y 
I tanggalin ko na ito. Tell your story, Walken. We don't have time. Okay. Sa team ko, okay, may ano ko dito idagdag na isang hitman. Pero, focus naman na tayo sa main mission. It is a Justice for Claire mission. Okay. So, atin muna tayo sa team briefing. Baik muna tayo sa base natin. Sa hideout. Albion confirms that the explosions seen in the skies over London were indeed an Albion drone project that was sabotaged by the DedSec insurgency. In an exclusive interview with GBB Radio 1, Albion founder and CEO Nigel Cass had this to say. Truth is, the supposed freedom fighters of DedSec have made London less free. That drone project was meant to replace Albion boots on the ground, let the city get back to normal, but now... I can't in good conscience stand my people down. That's not how I lead. Hmm. Cass went on to implore listeners to treat any suspected dead sec operatives as terrorists and to immediately report them to Albion. Black propaganda. <laughs> that lying Ross clot. He had a hit list as long as the Nile and now he plays the victim. And it's working. Sorry, that was too cheerful. Sadly, it's working. Too sad? It's what he does. Scares the shit out of people, then swoops in and plays the hero. We've got to show them what he really is. So that's his weakness, his image. If we shatter that, he falls apart. Mm -hmm. A few of us thought about that. Bugly, bring it up. This is Claire Waters, political dissident and podcaster, reported missing after teasing a salacious upcoming episode. Sadly, it never aired. So all we have is this. On the next episode of Buccaneer Radio, I'm chatting with someone from deep inside Nigel Cass's inner circle. He's promised me something that will expose Cass as the tyrant I know he is. This is gonna blow the roof right off White Tower. See you next week, pirates. Nigel would have spun that interview if it was spinnable. If he went off the waters for it, that tape's a smoking gun. We've got to have it. Claire was known to broadcast out of Freight One. You should begin searching there. Claire Waters appears to be an equal opportunity muckslinger. Albion is her target of choice, but she's railed against tech genius Sky Larson, SIRS, and Plan Kelly. Opinionated, isn't she? With dead tech behind her, she could do a lot of damage. The right kind of damage. She's been digging in Cass's shit for a while. If what she has isn't enough to squeeze his bollocks in a vice, then maybe she'll join you lot and help find something. Okay. Sana boy, is clear. Pinatahimik siya ni Nigel Cass. Okay. Ba't ang layo ng mga lugar nila? Okay, okay. used to broadcast from somewhere around here. That's all I've got, I'm afraid. Bloody analog technology. This girl is starting to rack up enemies. If we found her this easy, they will too. Let's go quickly. Santia. Ugh. 
So tama pala yun. Kailangan ko na spider bot Okay Ay, pinatay. I'd love to listen to you moan all day, but perhaps investigating her murder would be a better use of our time. You're right, Bugs. Let's find the bastards who did this and expose them. Let's have a look around. Lot of people have come through here. Several individuals. Boots rather than shoes. One with a tread unique to a certain paramilitary supplier. I think it's from their autumn collection. I bet you anything there, I'll be on supplier. Ah, Kelly Clan. Check out the graffiti. It's a bit much, no? Claire did release several podcasts critical of Clan Kelly, which you'd think they'd be used to by now. They're a criminal gang. They shouldn't expect flowers and thank you notes. Kellys don't tend to advertise their hit jobs, though. Something is not adding up. Ah, uh, if you frame up the like Kelly Clan. Hmm. Whoever kid clear stole her equipment but forgot this tablet. Bugs, I look at her, please. Tablet unlocked. Claire seems to have logged conversations on it. Oh, yeah. Okay, you've agreed to speak on the record. You are an intelligence technician at Albion and work closely with Nigel Cass, correct, Mr. Just you. I can't believe I'm doing this. If they were to find out. I know. Only have to step outside to see how Albion treats people. What do you have for us? Proof that... <laughs> proof that Nigel Cass was complicit in the bombings. What? But that's... Here, transfer mm -hmm. it to this secure storage drive. How solid is this information? It's a recording of him talking to some... <laughs> security, drop your weapons! <laughs> you can't do this! Gather all our equipment and get it to the carousel. Do! Take that wall, then get rid of this body. She can stay here. <laughs> Gang vengeance is an horrible crime, ain't it? Oh, Pinapatai. Pinapahi McClung. Me. Cass sent a squad of his goons for Claire and that other bloke. That recording's got to be the real deal. Bastard knew about the bombings. Albion must have Claire's equipment then, along with the audio file evidence. This is it then. Cass is finally going to appear for everything. We just need that file. The hitman said Carousel. Hmm. It's got to mean Carousel Plaza. Sounds like as good a place as any to start looking. So Carousel. Okay, we'll have it long.
The stolen evidence is here somewhere. Watch out, Albion security is thicker than whoever cleaned up that crime scene. And there's also a lot of them around. In other words, more last cloud to mash up. Can't say I'm sorry. After what we saw, they deserve everything that is coming. Yes, well, let's focus on finding Claire's equipment, shall we? Um. Ah. There we go, nice and easy. found Claire's equipment, including her secure storage drive, which shockingly appears not to have been tampered with, so the audio evidence is probably still intact. Come in, dispatch. Drones are en route to suspect. Sonny Muppet, is that the best you've got? <laughs> Sige lang Okay Buti marami ako dito uh, Agents na ginamit Na, na, na hitman It's just been taken into Albion custody. So long as you don't cock up that bad thing, you'll be my favorite operative today. Captured, were they? Well, on the plus side, it's normally quite expensive to have a big lad in a mask tie you up.
you found Claire's equipment, including her secure storage drive, which shockingly appears not to have been tampered with, so the audio evidence is probably still intact. Dispatch, deploying drones to apprehend the suspect. Okay, so we're going to go to the console. Here up there. Well, I know you're listening. Let's talk. We told you the Prime Minister would turn you down. Brits love to see private military contractors on foreign streets, but not their own. He's a fool! This whole city, this whole country's collapsing. The military's held together with duct tape. Police are running scared. Someone has to save the people, Nigel. Someone strong. <laughs> they do. And I've already worked it out. The ideal targets are the Toan Conference, Parliament, and King's College Hospital. I'll provide overseas tech teams for logistics, but you can source the bombs yourself. Non-negotiable. It cannot trace back to me. Hmm. You're forgetting something. And I'll get you access to filament, as agreed. Now go away. Now scarf her or they'll kill you for sure. Has a voice that makes you want to snap his smug bollocks in a pencil case, doesn't he? And Zero Day knew just which strings to pull to get what they wanted, didn't they? Filament. And Cass was willing to trade it for the keys to the city. Fuck. Don't know, fam. I think I always thought there was a chance for him to... Fuck! To be the man you thought he was. Sorry, Hamish. If that man ever existed, he's gone now. We have to get this information out there to the people. You're right. When you lot get the chance, come to Piccadilly Circus. Been working with bags on something. And this proof is just the topping we needed. Okay, so we're going to For our justice for Claire. It's a Piccadilly Circus.
Watch for Hamish, surprise. Away, you piece of trash. London, you've been lied to. Nigel Cass and his Albion peacekeepers intend to permanently control his city. The ideal targets are the Toan Conference, Parliament and King's College Hospital. I'll provide overseas tech teams for logistics, but you can source the bombs yourself. Non-negotiable, it cannot trace back to me. Nigel Cass collaborated with a terrorist to bomb this city. Then he set up an orbital drone program called Themis that will target you based on your stolen data. I will not allow anyone, not even myself, to jeopardize Themis. I'm huh. giving you the truth. Do as you will. Actually, fuck that. Resist. Not bad, not bad if I do say so, innit? <laughs> Hamish! Haha. <laughs> Your hermitage finally wore out, it's welcome. Yeah, well, can't lock myself away from the world forever. Got a lot to make up for, don't I? Besides, you sorry lot need all the help you can get. Check it. Hey! Hey! Fucking wankers! You can lead Albion to water, but you can't make him... Uh. that to every news outlet I could think of. They're gonna have it on the loop for a while. And when the people tweak to what it means, Cass is done. They'll be removed, prosecuted for high treason. They'll have no choice. We've done it. Congratulations, team. <sighs> you know what would be nice right now? A glass of sparkling white and an evening in the red light district. There is still the matter of Zero Day. You know, the rogue hacker group that conspired with Cass and Mary Kelly to blow up London. Jesus, Backley, all work and no play. Give the squad a second or two to bask in our victory. Safe to say it won't last long. I doubt this is the reaction you were expecting, but Nigel Cass is in the news again. The government has convened to review its contract with Albion. Mm. Nigel Cass himself has responded to requests that he should surrender to the authorities in a heated call with the GBB. Just shut up and listen to me. I will not be removed by the government or anyone else. I will die first. And many will die with me. They're calling for huh. blood. They'll have it. This city belongs to me. I am its shepherd and I will slaughter my flock before I relinquish it. Cass has barricaded himself in his White Tower headquarters and threatened to kill anyone that tries to stop him. He is heavily armed and considered extremely dangerous. Huh. Shit. He's gone off the deep end. He's liable to take it to the streets in his state. We have no choice. We have to get to White Tower and stop him. Okay. Okay. Okay, mga to lang. Dito lang muna tayo sa... Mission natin na latest natin nun is yung uh, Justice for Clear And now we are uh, on our London's Protectors uh, which is the Albion Mission uh, Nagkabistuhan na, nalaman na ng lahat ng tao uh, regarding sa intention ni Nigel Cass So I hope nag-enjoy kayo doon and uh, para hindi kayo maging outdated sa mga gameplays ko and future videos Just don't forget to subscribe and like and comment and share at uh, I hope makita-kita pa tayo sa susunod kong video. So, thank you so much and see you.